shrinking. Mm. Mm, three, two, one. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> That'll possibly be an intro. Right there. <laughs> Ben and Chris here, Kevin Karari's, and welcome, welcome to, to another video. video. Uh, this one is a uh, well, S two K. Finalising S two K. It is. We're so bloody close. She's close for the road. We're down here on a very, very, very wet Sunday. Yeah, it's minging. Although it has stopped, mate. It looks like it. Yeah. Anyway, so what we're doing today is we're going to lower the car on the coilovers on the BCs. Yes. A bit. Dial in the suspension. Try and camber in the front wheels a smidgen. Get the Jay's racing front end on and hopefully give her a little wash, just a quickie, just a quick and then thing. we can basically reveal to you <clears throat> the finished S2K. Never gonna be finished. It's not finished, ever. but you know what I mean. And then all I need is a wheel alignment, and then we're fucking rocking and rolling, my brother, for bike. So we're gonna start on the rears. We'll show you one, we're not gonna show you both because it's the same both sides, obviously. It's very simple, hopefully. They're brand new, it's never been outside on these BCs apart from the We took side. a measurement already and it's about 40 mil at the minute, isn't it? It's set at about 40 mil. Um, yeah, from the tyre to the top edge of the arch. Of the arch. You want to drop it down to... So we're going to go for 30. Yeah, you want about 10 mil, don't you, between the arch? We'll drop it 30 mil, put the wheels back on, <coughs> see what she sits like, and go from there, go really. From there. So it'll be a little bit of fanning around. I'm just excited so, about getting this bumper on because I've been so excited to I actually am, get this bumper on for ages, and I? Yeah. The amount of times I've said to you, I can't wait to get this bumper on. Yeah. So, so I'm uh, buzzing for that one. But anyway, I shall, um, I shall film and Ben shall show you what our process is next. And this was for you, Robert. Drinking! <laughs> oh my god. Oh gosh, what's he done? Start this side, sorry. Blinded by the lights? Blinded. Yeah, yeah, let's start this side, mate. So. This is where we're at. Really. So where we're at, yeah, it is pretty straightforward. But we just you just love to see our beautiful faces. Especially mine. Here we go. This is where we're at at the moment. So we get this battered. There we go. So like Ben said, we're going to drop it about 30 millimeters. And yeah. Never adjusted coilovers in my life, so oh, you haven't you? Yes. So this is a bit new to me. I've never adjusted the coilover. Very simple, mate. So yeah, there are, some are slightly different to others, but bloody light. Don't you think Ben's dressed for the occasion today, guys? As well, look. Rachel calls it the sexy shirt. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, probably, probably not even watching. Also, it is an exciting day for young Raquel today yes. as well. Yes. Don't say what it is. Um, of course we'll do a reveal, not. But. but yeah, that's going to be uh, exciting We've stuff. We've got another car coming on the channel. We've got another car coming to the channel, guys. So it's going to be exciting stuff. Well, yeah. And I'm well pleased for you, Rach. Um, it's going to be pretty it's ace. Sick, isn't it? It's going to be ace. We so. basically went there this morning. It's Sunday morning. So it's the Sunday just gone. And uh, she's pulled the trigger. We bought another car. <laughs> <laughs> and it's ace. And it's Japanese. And it's going to be very, very fun. And it's a bit different, isn't it? It's yeah. something a bit different. For us, it is. For us, yeah. I'm looking forward to it. It'll be good. And she wants to do it with us as well, so it's going to be fun, mate. Anyway, right, so what we've got to do is we don't touch the top piece. That's your preload. All that, So that top one is just your preload, and that little one is basically just a locking nut for that one to keep that one tight so it doesn't adjust. So that adjusts your preload. We don't need to adjust the preload because that comes already set. That one there is your locking collar. For your ride height so we're basically loosening that up to 30 mil yeah, which is going to be yeah. close to that anyway i think i don't even know if we'll get 30 mil we'll try it should do and then you put your spanner on here spin it that way i think and it basically spins the whole shock and that's what lowers and heightens your car so what i would suggest is 
making sure that these are tight first before we do anything. So I'll get the old rubber mallet and give it a little bash. Ooh. It's that tight, isn't it? Or loosening it? It's loosening it. Is it? Yes, yeah. not. Yeah, because you're going, you're turning it counterclockwise. Am I? Yeah. These things different ways, though, don't they? Loosen it or tighten it? I don't know. Yeah, I do know, it. You want to get that way. Okay. <coughs> you bloody nose. This one I thought went the other way. Let's try it, see what happens to us. I don't know, no, lad. No, that's loosening it. What, the way I said? One goes one way, one goes the other way. How does it? I believe. Like so. Yeah, that's tight, isn't it? Oh. There we go. Right, then we loosen this bad boy here. Let's so loosen the bottom ring. <coughs> which I think is that way. Yep. Wind him up. Oh, uh, it's Gerald. Spin it, mate. Yeah. Gerald and Geraldine. There we go. Easy as that, look. And then what a lot of people do, you can either take your measurement from there or there, but I'm thinking that we we just take the measurement off of the actual locking ring itself. Okay. And we get the doofa. And this one has got the like the inny outy bit. He's got all the gear, yes. So we'll use this bit. We should be able to. What's that? 16. See, we're not going to, I don't think we're going to be able to lower it that much. Ooh. 18. We've got 20, do we? See how she sits. I don't think we're going to be able to do it anymore, to be honest. 19.8. Close enough, isn't it? 19.8? No. <coughs> Is it twenty point zero four. Well it's gotta be twenty. I'm not happy about that. That's fine. It's not. Mate, we're not gonna get it bang on, is us? Yes. Then Well now why is it saying twenty point three now then? I don't know, it's fine, mate. That's naught point one of a fucking millimetre. That's nothing. Alright mate, it's gonna bug you then. It's not. <laughs> Then, I think, Just this is up. the annoying bit. Oh, he's moved. Oh, he's moved. Sorry. I think we spin it. Uh, that way. Yeah, that yeah. should spin. And then that spins the whole shot. Is that lowering it or hiring it? Not to tell, isn't it? Yeah, because it's reducing the spring. Yeah, because look, the yeah. spring is, yeah. I hate these fucking things. Yeah, that's definitely lowering it. Uh. What are you doing? <laughs> right, we don't even feel all this bit, do we? Not really. So we'll, we'll wind that down. We'll check in in a bit with a trunk. Well then. Well, what we've done is <coughs> we've maxed it out. <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. Because we can't go any lower. So this is all we're going to get. So I'm hoping. This will be enough. I'm not going to put all the nuts on. No, because we've got to take them off again, but. but this is it. This is this is the moment then, isn't it? We'll see. Oh, she says. <laughs> I'll we'll see how she sits. I'll do it super slowly, so you keep an eye in case it's, in case it's yeah. too low. And it fucking hits there. Uh, this is it, this is a big moment, Benj. It's a big moment. It's a very big moment. Super slow. Yeah. At least I'll riff all my arches off and we've got to start all over again. <laughs> I hate this Jack, you can't do it super slow. Uh, 
today. I was trying to go slowly. And so he's out of fuel. There she well, goes. He starts up, fuel gauge is reading top all. And then <laughs> Put it on top, sorry. Alright, there we go. Now we're going slow. I'm nearly on the ground. She's on the ground. Have a look at Go on. Now she's coming down. That's the jack. I think I might. <laughs> it's definitely lower. Fucking hell, mate. How, how is it looking now? Very close. Is it? Are you, um, are you close? Are you all right? That's it, I'm off. You're off? Yeah. Fuck me, man, that's low. I can't, I can't, I can just about get the tip of my finger in the Ooh. arch. <laughs> Fuck me, I might, I might have to go up a bit, mate, because of this. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that, that side's, uh, this side's work, lower. Is it? Yeah. Then that side. It might be just because I was sat there. Oh, yeah, it is, isn't it? It might be because of how it's sat, mate. It might be, because don't forget we're on blocks, it could be the level of the unit. Yeah, and we're, uh, I think we're tilted like that. Yeah. Because the level of this floor. Yeah, yeah, it probably is. So in theory, it should sit the same as this side. Yeah, that's. I mean, that looks amazing. Don't get me wrong. Yeah, but you've got to be sensible. It's, it's very close. How the wheels are tucked like, underneath, and we need to come up a little bit more, do we? If you look at it from this way. Yeah. It's bloody perfect the way the wheels are tucked under. Oh, it really is. Yeah. Like perfect. Oh, it is. Yeah. Look that, at that. There is touching. That's is that touching the arch? Yeah. So we need to come, come up. up a couple of turns. A smidgen. That's fucking low. I hmm. love it. <laughs> yeah, so we need to jack it up again. Wheel back off. Wheels back off. And wind them up a smidge. Would you reckon we should go? 10 mil? Yeah. About 10? Yeah. So I don't. You don't, I don't want the, no. rear, the suspension too stiff. Yeah, yeah, you don't Obviously. want to um, risk damaging anything, mate. Fuck that. So we'll come, we'll come up. About like you say, now. it's amazing as that looks. Well, that's a good place, good way to do it. I think is, we've dropped it as much as it will go, and now we'll we'll slowly bring it up. Oh, it's still up too quick there. Oh, it's going to fall over then. <laughs> right, so jack it back up, wheels off. Raise it up another 10 millimetres. Right, she's down. So yeah, we raised her up 10 millimetres. Uh, I think she sits just about right, don't you? She does. So see, yeah, it's very close. But I've stiffened up the dampening on it. So there's not so it, much it, travel. Was it you give it eight clicks on it? I've just hardened it two more. So it's, I clicked it all the way to hard and then came back to it. Looks a bit like Sideshow Bob. <laughs> Cheeky twat. So then, got to put blocks on her, obviously. Lower but she can't get the bloody jack underneath it. We've got to do that now at Carbon Card Aries, haven't we? We've all got to put our cars on blocks to get jacks underneath. Even Marky Mark over there. Yeah. I'm not sure the same. Oh, so much better. It's fucking weather. I'm going to give it a good clean. It looks lovely. So much better. So much better. Right then, Ben, get her up then. She's got her patches on there as well. Poorly patches.
customised That's the most I've driven this car in three months. What? That's the most I've driven this car in three months. <laughs> two foot forward, two foot back. But is it... Is it trunking? Yeah, it's trunking! <laughs> right then, right guys. Right there guys. <laughs> As the Robster would say. Time to tackle the front now. Well, I reckon we do this. Set the camera up and get the wheels back on first, I think. And you reckon? See how much that drops it. Okie dokie. The camber is in there. Well, you're pleased we didn't have to touch the rears anyway, aren't you? But you've have, you loosened these already, haven't you? So I've, I've, un, I've had them undone. Yes, I have. So if you look in here, we've got two bolts. This one this side there, and one that's on the same the other side. And it's like an oval shaft. And when you turn them, it's like an egg. Do you know what I mean? I don't know if I'm actually filming it there. I think I am. Yeah, I'll show you. And there's little lines that you can see there and we've just got to match the lines up the same each side i'm assuming i don't know what the fuck i'm doing i'm not gonna lie <laughs> at least you're honest mate um but you'll see when we loosen it you'll you'll watch this it goes like that when you when as you spin the nut it spins the egg-shaped barrel and you imagine an egg shape going like that so it's going like that with the hub mm -hmm. see what i mean so we need to bring the bottom out Beautiful. sink the top in much. Don't know. <laughs> we're going to go maximum, Mark. That's what we're going to do. Maximum. I'm just going to have a little sit down, I think. <sighs> Fuck off, mate. I've got a busy week weekend next weekend. Well, if you turn the light on, you better see what sockets they are. I can see what sockets they are, mate. Well, we know what it's like now. Approaching 41. <laughs> Dick. There it is. Inch waist. Shut up. Yeah, I had two dinners the other night before you said anything. <laughs> He fucking did. Spaghetti and meatballs and then he had a fucking takeaway. No mate, I had spaghetti and meatballs with the kids. Kaylee worked late, she come home and then she was like, I'm really hungry. So I said, well, what do you want? Do I really fancy a pizza? Well, you, to order a pizza, you've got to do like the minimum delivery, haven't you? Spend £10. So I was like, well, I'm not going out and getting it. I said, yeah, so, you got a portion of chips. Nah, so, I said, okay, then I'll get a burger, I'll get a burger and chips yeah. then. As well as? Get your meatballs. Was, was it nice, mate? Oh, it's amazing. King of the grill. Amazing. Yeah, so good. Right, anyway, that's enough about my fatness. <laughs> it's a harsh yourself, Chris. You've got your, you got your stretchy pants on today. You can't even tell. Look at these there. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo! Right, tell you what we did first. What have you done now? You've got the wrong size again, haven't you? No, the right size. I was going to get a little bit of lube. Never going dry, Christy. He looks a bit. He looks very swagger in that shirt, doesn't he? Unless you want a snap banjo, then we're going dry. Oh, no, don't like a snap banjo. There he is, look. The old penetrating oil. Good stuff, that. It is good stuff. A bit in there as well. Lovely. Oh, feeling I'll be using quite a bit of that next weekend. Well, I bought two more tins. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. Oh, for yours, yeah. Yeah. Look at hell, yeah. That's going to be, yeah. Uh, I think that is going to be the most stressful one we've done yet. What, more stressful? The engine was a fucking pain in the ass, but yeah. I fully blame you on trying to get it done in an afternoon. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I was impatient, wasn't I? But your next one is going to be very testing. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Very testing. Hey. Okay. You can get it up there, yeah. Yeah, you will. Too narrow. You will have to take the front bumper off. I'm not, oh, I'm not fucking taking <laughs> that bumper off. <laughs> How many times has that been off? That is fucking staying put. Yeah, you need some light. Like that, long ones where you can drive up and then it brings it up and around. Oh, is this? Yeah, they're fucking narrow, though, isn't they, mate? I like the white, I prefer it going on a wider one. Yeah, I prefer it on a wider You could probably extend them, couldn't we? Cut them and fucking. Oh! Oh, hello. Right, so if you watch this. Let's see how it moves oh, ben, now. Ben, turn that light. Stop! Stop! Fucking hell. Angle the light that way. Oh, well, that's it's getting in the way of my shot. Oh, all right, Mr. Fucking Photographer. <laughs> Cinema to fuck off. Fuck off. Cinemographer. Because now, now I can. Cinemog. Uh, I don't know. We don't do language. Cinemog. But now I'm right. In so you're using that nut there on the front, so that nut just holds it, but the one on the back actually turns it. So I've got a ratchet spanner on the back, and then when I hold that one and turn that one. See it's moving yes. in and out? Yes. Yeah. Okay. 
let's just do it all the way around. All right, so it's going back in now. So that'll bring the, going back in will bring the wheel out, wheel out won't it? So we need to go that way. That but way. There's little lines on it. So if we can get the lines the same on both sides, then it should be that simple. But the only thing is, when you do it, it's obviously going to affect the toe in, toe out, going in a straight line, which is obviously why I'm getting a wheel, a wheel alignment done. So yeah, should we just go max? You don't want to stuck them down, don't you? Right, let's bring it all the way in. And then all the way back out. Which I think is about there. That's on its max, isn't it? Yeah. That's maximum camber. Should be. I'm going to tighten that one up without moving the rear one. They're fucking undone. Yeah. Because apparently, for new ones, I have to research it just in case. But there's no way we get them out, I don't think. And I think you're looking at about seven or eight hundred quid. What? Yeah. Shit, they're dead. I was very happy. Mm. <laughs> yes. Right, get a wheel on then. Right. I'll try and show you what I've done. If you look on there, I don't know whether you can see this at all, but on the top of the, it looks like a washer. There's little nicks, like little lines, yeah. and that's your that's basically how you can set the camera both oh, the same each right. side. So what I've done is oh, I don't know if you can see this at all, but the second notch in I've done level with the top of the little metal straight bit. And I've just done the same on both sides. I'm not sure if that's maximum. I think you can maybe go one more click, but we're going to get the wheels back on, aren't we? Drop it, see how it tucks in and then lower it and then it should be golden right then Benj where are we at with the front right. camber's done I've done the camber which we showed you um, it's as far as they can go in I think so that's going to have to do and I'm not spending loads of money on new camber arms and that at the moment so what I've done is I've raised we need to drop 40 mil so I've raised that up 40 mil using the little doofer thingy but then once raising that up I've measured from the top of that ring to the to top, the top of that, of that there with the spring sits on and it's 120 mil so we're going to wind it down now and then all we've got to do is make sure that the top of there to the top of there is 120 mil once we've lowered it so we've got to wind it down that much basically have you got to take that off as well then no i, I already have it's loose it oh right okay so that attaches to there yeah so, so i've just taken that off line, yeah right? i've taken that off obviously to loosen it off so now i've got about 20 minutes of winding should be great fun well, don't. Yeah, no, but yeah, he turns it around and makes me look like a cop. Uh, we're having a fucking hard day down the unit today. Um, me and Mark are just chilling. Chilling. We're just sat here, like, you know. And then there's uh, poor little Benji over there. How much have you got a wine, Ben? <laughs> We're going quite low. So I've got about another five mil. So that look a bit cool handy, yeah. I need a glove. We'll make a mechanic out of him yet. <laughs> I do need a glove. Can you give me a glove, Chris? Oh, what yeah. the fuck? Oh, yeah. Sorry, you got a. Get up! Nice. I'm fucking drip it here. At least for a joke, yeah. and welding right, my brow, bitch. What the fuck is that? <laughs> you should have said a glove. You didn't say what glove. Okay. So I'll give you a welding glove. Brilliant. Would you like the welding Something glove? I could work it with. I'm fucking done now. <laughs> but the other side, do yeah. Oh, yeah. True. <laughs> God, I better ask them to rub around all these things. Maybe I'll get with these. What's this fucking tape measure going on? It's right next to me. Just throw things at him today. Ew. A bit late for the fucking gloves. Though. I hope you sanitised. Tape measure, Ben. We wait later on tonight. We put oh, moisturiser after his bubble bath, and be oh, all oh, oh, that all day. That's it. All right, have a little measure. <laughs> Can't see that. Well, I have to put it back on. Oh, 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 o
weather is so shit today. I haven't tightened it fully yet, I won't get a little off tap. I'm getting slightly dripped on as well from somewhere up there. You can always move a chair. No, it's all fun here. I want to try and catch a drip coming down. Drips won't get wet, they get bigger. Oh, I'll get that, I'll get that one in. Sideshow. There he is. Sweating, mate. What the fuck is my wheel doing in mud? I christened it for you. What the fuck? What? It's raining as fuck. I want to get a bucket of water in my car. Um, I'm going to jet wash it anyway. You only have to just go and park it outside. Didn't you say that? I'll put your wheel in the mud. <laughs> yeah, I said I'd christen your wheel. Oh, look how he's coming. Up. Why don't you take your shirt off, Benj? <laughs> oh, there was a drip. Oh. See, what Ben doesn't really get is this is actually a little bit of payback payback for what when i've done all that hard work wax in my car he sat and watched most of it <laughs> i looked over and he was I laid out work. on the casting couch what smoking a fag I, what? what did i do put your girls in your bonnet oh yeah he did actually i better help him yeah, plus i really need his help next weekend for mine so i better help him yeah. and i have been helping i've been taking your wheels on and off here Right, quick little update with my Uncle Fester here. Um, yeah, she's still, a, well, she's down on the ground. And, oh my God, she is so close. Look at this. Jesus. Ben's had to actually do the other side now. He actually had to cut this part off of the bumper because it just would not clear. Um, yeah, he's hacking away at now, but we you see the other side. All right, chopper. Yeah. Look at this. Oh, that's so close. So tight. The lights are blind, didn't they? Got a wash bottle hose there. Just very close there. Hey, Ben. Hey. The green tab is catching a lot of colour. Yeah, it's only a tab. It's not. It's not actually doing anything. It's We're uh, extremely close. So we might go a bit higher, I think. Yeah, mate, that's, yeah. <laughs> Turn the wheel and I'll uh, show them. So there was a tab there that came down here to cut out because when you turned the wheel, it fucking hit it. Look at this one. Look how fucking low it is. Keep going, mate, all the way. Going <laughs> back again? What's this? What? What was that? Did you catch it? Yeah, it might have gone. Oh, hang on. No, I'm gonna. It needs to go up a bit anyway, mate. If I want it to clear this better, so we're gonna have to go back up again. Too low. Right, what a kerfuffle we've been having here. So basically, the issue has been we've we've raised it up again another 10 mil because that section there, when you're on full lock this way towards you, it's it's rubbing on here and pinging it out, and we've tried to move the wing down a bit, but we can't. So we've raised it up a bit in order to make that gap bigger and we've got like five mil where it clears now so we're gonna have to sit like that until we get the wheel alignment done because that's going to kick the wheels in and out obviously because where we've been messing around with it and then go from there but i'm going to just ride it as it is i mean it sits fairly low so it's one of them things i've gone with such aggressive wheels that i've kind of Made a rod for my own back. Hello, right, Christy. I'm fed up with these fucking wheels, honestly. It's been on and off, on and off, on and off, but it's got to be right. So, 
And we're gonna move on to, now that's done, the front end, get the front end on, get that bolted on, and then we can show you. We don't need it, we're not gonna show you as fit in the front end. We'll just show you when it's on, so we'll check back in in a momento. Exciting. She's done, front bumper's on. Hey, Nick, Chrissy, this is tidied up. Oh yeah, she's we're on. We've just given her a rinse, a snow foam and a rinse, and we're gonna dry it. Look, I so bear in mind it's not fully, fully detailed. Do that another day, obvs. But I'm um, like buzzing, like proper, proper buzzing. She looks sexy as fuck. She looks amazing, like amazing, amazing. Yeah, it does so look awesome. We've just got to show you now, haven't we? Just, I can't wait for you to see it. You've just got to cure it. Oh, shall I shall cure it. Shall I cure it? Shall we? Now? I think, well, actually, if we both cure it. Oh, yeah, we could do it in three, two, one. Q Cinematics. Ooh, Ooh faster. There we go. Right after Gerald's finished with it tonight. I'm like in awe right now. Quite literally in awe of my own car for once. Like it's ridiculous. It's amazing. I'm like. It looks so good. It's a little issue still on that front left wing. If I'm on full lock, depending on how the car is on uneven ground, it slightly catches, doesn't it? Yeah. Only so we need to look at that, but. But then again, the alignment and that's got to be done. Yeah, I'm going to wait till the stuff. wheels have been aligned and then see if it sorts it because it is. That wheel is kicking out slightly, obviously, because we've lowered it. But she's actually driven out of the unit today. Man, we literally just drove it like ten yards. That's amazing. More than like two. It's the most that those wheels have been. So happy. Been christened now. The wheels have been christened. It's ridiculous. It is, mate. It's crazy. Fucking, I can't stop looking at it. Like it's, it's weird. It's like it's not mine, but it is. And that's the bit that I'm struggling to get in my head that it's actually my car. Do you know what I mean? It's an amazing feeling. It's a lot of hard work, a lot of money. It is. And a fucking shitload of money. I'm sure a little bit of stress as well, Benjamin. We can thank, we can thank Betsy Lou. Yeah. For yeah. a lot of it. Because if I hadn't sold the FN, this car wouldn't be nowhere near in this, like this, like fucking show worthy. Although she's I mean? gone on to better things. So that's she good. Has. Watched your video, Danny, of a Betsy Lou on, on the dyno. And yes. it was nice to see her making some decent power and the engine was running sweet. And nice to see that someone's actually doing stuff with her. Yeah, taking it to the next level. It's decent. It's amazing. So, Good yeah. Good stuff. I wanted to thank a few people. I've got a little list here. Look. It's done it all proper. Am I on that list, Ben? Or? Nope. Okay. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> you are. You're top of the list. Oh. Oh. That's true. Okay, thank yous. Right. Is it, I'm just going to try not to get emotional because this is a bit of an emotional moment for me because it's it's done. Do you know what I mean? To a degree. Would it's not like, It's not done. But... Would you like me to leave the room? or? No. I'll do that. I'll come down on my own. Do that bit. 
I was lying and naked on the leather. Right, obviously I want to thank you and Marky Mark over there, because I wouldn't have done it without you, basically. It's as simple as that. We've literally busted our asses off on this car for the last three or four months. We have. Literally. In between doing off. mine as well, so it's all been well, I bought it busy. in January, sold the FN March? March, April. February, March, yeah, something like that. Yeah. So from March, April, May. That's brilliant. <laughs> Fucking camera. Camera issues again. We started it in, we only started in, we'll say, January, February, about March time, I reckon it was. So March, April, May, June, we've just started July, so it's nearly five months. That's mm -hmm. how long we've been working on this and got it to this stage. Ourselves. What a transformation. The only thing yeah. that we didn't do, out of us three, was the paint and the wheel alignment, which hasn't been done yet, but we'll do this that's one. it. We've done everything else. Yeah. It's fucking amazing. So anyway, obviously I want to thank you for just whatever for being you thanks mate you're welcome mate Marky Mark obviously for all the welding that you've done on the arches because we wouldn't be here without any of that give us a shout Mark Mark is here hi Mark hi he's over there <laughs> oh that's a gay one I want to thank obviously. Rachel just for being Rachel and supporting me and for, oh. for like helping me with decisions that I wouldn't have made without her because she's just one of them people that just go look just fucking do it and I'm like I'm in an R and about it well a prime example of that is that we bought a car for her this morning, which is coming to the channel. Can't wait to show you. Picking it up in literally an hour or so's time. Uh, I want to thank Desmond, R34 Des. Well, sorry, Des. It's not actually drivable at the minute, is it? For sorting... Oh, you little bitch. No, I'm not being a bitch about it. I'm gutted for him. That's what I mean. I is didn't your, want to bring up the R34. It's your drivable. Yeah, mate. Just about. If I don't go full lock left, I'm fine. <laughs> Only messing Des. Hope you get it sorted, mate. I hope so. Because he's he's missing out on the first two shows, unfortunately, which sucks. So anyway, thank you to Des for sorting out all the tyres for me and JDM Garage or Garage or however you want to say it. For getting them. Fiberworks, obviously, for supplying the all the kit. The wings, the front wings, the overfenders, the other spoiler, which I haven't put on yet, which will be going on soon, but I just concentrated on getting it to this point. Do you know what I mean? Dino Days, obviously, for hooking me up with the, the coilovers, the exhaust system, braided lines, which haven't been gone on yet, but they will. I just needed to get it <coughs> drivable. Little bits like that we'll do later on down the, the pads line. Pads as well, didn't you? Uh, pads as well, I've got to go on it. So massive thank you to Danny, obviously, and the lads at Dino Days for hooking me up with some ridiculously good deals to enable me to get it done quicker and spend less money, which is amazing. Come on, mate, we're going to a commercial break in a minute. Craig at Solway Carver Hospital for painting it and doing a very good job, and now it's actually been cleaned. The paint match is fucking bow on. It really like, does, yeah. yeah it's, decent. it's really fucking good. It was like, like matching really a, a silver car on brown, really. Before it was. It was, it was I'm so happy with the paint match. So thank you, Craig. Team Tyres for fitting the tyres, for doing the alignments and everything else, which hasn't been done yet, but it is. And Cosmos Racing for hooking me up with a ridiculously good deal on the wheels after I nearly paid 400 quid more for them. Yeah, that was very If I missed anyone, sorry. And all you guys. Well, thank everyone for watching and following the build. It's the, not finished. You're just feeling the love at the minute, aren't you? I'm, just, you're like, I'm overwhelmed everyone. with happiness It's good, though. Right it's now. nice to be happy, Sick. isn't it? Everything's it's going nice. well and it's just little niggly bits that need <clears> sorting. But overall, mate, I am fucking over the moon. Like, I'm over the fucking moon. Oh, mate, all right. <laughs> so, I can't stop looking at it. I'm going to go home tonight and stream about it, naked. <laughs> you just had naked into it. Well, why not? Yeah, Maybe yeah. just my sexy shirt. See you later, Mark. See you later, mate. So, yeah, Thanks there we have coming. it. I think that's, uh, yeah, that's a good point to end the video. A very good point. I'm so bloody over the moon. Like You should be, mate. It's a lot of money and effort gone into ace, it. Ace, mate. Should we just have one more quick look? <laughs> look at it, look. <laughs> look at her, oh, mate. That's it. Oh, I've thanked matey as well, I've got the bumper off. What do you think of my number plate as well? How cool is that? A little CCD number plate, a little mini one. Oh, mate, it's just lush. The exhaust poking out the back. Oh. <laughs> Fucking look at her, mate. She's looking very trunky. Beautiful. So, that's a good point to end the video. She's looking very trunky. So, thank you, everyone. I've just thanked a million people, but you know what to do. Go into the outros. Get your discount codes for everything. Thank you to all our sponsors. Obviously, go and follow them all. If you do follow us on Facebook, that's here. Oh, yeah. And our Instagram is oh, up above top me of Ben's edge. cap there. Oh, hello. Lovely. So thank you all for watching. We love you all, and we shall see you on, on the, the next video. video. Peace, Peace out. out. Bye-bye.